one individual who was in a village um, spent his whole life uh, making sure that people were looked after. He prepared wood, he prepared food, he prepared clothing, he prepared many things for the people so that any time something happened in the community, this individual was ready for whatever it was. And at the time that the man was going to pass into the next world or, or die, um, Hells, the Transformer, came to him and he said, um, because you've been such a good person, because you've brought many things to your people in your community, um, I'm going to allow you to stay. So I'll transform you into cedar, the cedar tree, which the Salish people call the tree of life. In thinking about what cedar man should look like, he needs to have that, that look on his face that was one of um, comfort and security and strength, but also giving and forgiving, always ready. And that's what came out in the face for me. He would be coming from a stump of a cedar tree itself and bringing life to a new tree, like the, the green branches or those branches of the tree. So all aspects of him are changing from human to cedar tree which, like I say, is still very important to our people.